Denise Brokover. I'm the Collections Curator and Research Center Manager at the Ryerson Image Center. The foundations of what we know as the Ryerson Image Center today started back in 1968 when several faculty members here at Ryerson started a teaching collection to support the um, photography curriculum at Ryerson University. So the first print I thought we would look at is um, a print by Paul Strand, who was an American photographer, um, and this is from a series of images he did that became known as the Mexican Portfolio. So in this composition you see basically a, a scene of, of Christ presented in a very theatrical way. And what I like about this image is the way that you're sort of seeing a scene within a scene or a frame within a frame, if you will. So a large portion of the collection is comprised of the Black Star Collection, which is nearly 300,000 press photographs from the New York City agency Black Star, which was a photojournalism uh, agency. The subject of this photograph is actually Martin Luther King Jr. being arrested in Montgomery, Alabama in 1958. So for this series called Faces, Joe Spence worked with a number of other women to create masks of their own faces, and you can see them uh, wearing those masks here. So it's this idea of how, kind of questioning how one is presented in the media and you know the mask of oneself that one has to put on in society. While the public might be more familiar with the Ryerson Image Center's exhibition program, we are also a research center that exists for the collecting and study of photography and is available to students and faculty at Ryerson University as well as to scholars from around the world.